Hello there, my dear subscribers. Let me share what really works here on YouTube. In my opinion, I tested a lot in the past and I made it all. And let me share my experience. Probably this can help you. For me, this was finally a big eye opener. We have the posts. We can contact some viewers, some subscribers, but really few. Then we have the horizontal live streams. I tested them out. I thought it's a good option to talk to my viewers and make a Q&A. But there were some viewers, there were some subscribers, really honest ones, but not a big deal. And then the vertical live streams, quite new. I tested them out. The same thing. I thought as people can easily switch by swiping into another stream, the way to contact new viewers would be perfect. But it's not. Sometimes you will join the stream and leave the stream and join the stream and leave the stream. They hide themselves. They have no interest to be in contact with you. You make a live stream to be in contact with the viewer, but the viewer hiding themselves and just watch from behind and go to the next stream. In this case, we can make a normal video. You can hide yourself behind the camera, talk to the camera, make a perfect video and then upload it. And then we have the shorts itself. And the more you try the shorts, the more you realize this is a completely different audience. An audience that first just wants to swipe is probably quite young. And even when you have related videos, no one will watch it. Okay, you can contact some new viewers and you can contact some of your subscribers, but it's minuscule. So when you ask me what really works, the normal horizontal video. The normal horizontal video. Here you can go into depth and people, when they are interested, they follow you. And believe me, when people first watch the first one, two minutes, they are into the topic and they will follow. What does this mean? You can waste your time. You can put your effort to the post. You can make vertical live streams. You can make horizontal live stream. You can create shorts like crazy. But there's nearly no more time left to create these basic horizontal videos. Do you agree? Some people might say, I have to get some from here, some from there, some from there. But I think this is wasting our time. We really should focus on one topic. We really should focus on one certain thing. YouTube offers a lot. And when we do everything, it's not for our good. There might be people that are just making shorts. And some people, they are just concentrating on live streams. But when you want to build an audience with your expertise showing in your horizontal videos, I would say, and I do it now more than before, because I learned it the hard way. I put a lot of effort in it. And I didn't do it just one, two weeks. I made it years. And don't come here with the algorithm. Mm -mm. I tested all these special parts that might attract the algorithm. And by the way, there are so many people trying to interpret the algorithm. They will never know how this works. YouTube will never show how it works. They are just guessing by their own experience, but they have no insight in the algorithm. This is so complex. This is really complex. Even a normal YouTube employee does not even know the details of the algorithm. So don't believe what these specialists talk, how the algorithm works. Go with your experience, observe and see what's happening. And when you see only few results, then make something different. Few results is not something that we can grow. When there's few result, this is not burning. There is no flame in it. Only when we hit 
the right target for us. And we see, wow, this is exploding. There's exponential growth. Focus on this. Just my advice, because I know a lot of my viewers, a lot of my subscribers are creators themselves. And they love to hear an honest opinion. Thank you very much for following. And here's way more good stuff in my channel.